Welcome to iLecture Online and here's our next lesson in how to integrate and here we're going to use a very very useful method called the integration by substitution and this is actually a very wide ranging method that can be used in all kinds of circumstances, all kinds of cases, very fundamental of integration and so we're going to see a lot of examples here. The concept, the concept is very simple. So if you have something that looks like this, in order to integrate this we have to have what we call the proper differential and in order to understand how to get that, we use a method called the method of substitution. We're going to go ahead and take what's inside the parentheses here and substitute that for another variable. Let's say the variable u. So we're going to say let u equal what's inside the parentheses. So this is 3x minus 8. And then we're going to take the derivative of u with respect to x. So the next step is take the du dx and the du dx of 3x minus 8 is equal to simply 3. Then we cross multiply the dx over here to so say du is equal to 3 dx and then if we solve this for dx we can say that dx is equal to du divided by 3. And Now what we're going to do is we're going to substitute this in for 3x minus 8 and we're going to substitute this for dx and when we do that we get the following. Right? So this becomes the integral of 5 times, instead of 3x minus 8, we're going to write u to the 4th power. Instead of dx, we're going to write du over 3. Then the next step, we're going to take the 5, take it outside the integral sign, and divide by 3 takes outside the integral sign. So this cannot be written as 5 over 3 times the integral of u to the 4th du. And now you can see that this is a nice, simple, easy format that you know how to integrate. So let's do the integral. So this is equal to 5 over 3 times u to the fifth power over 5 plus a constant of integration. We can see that the 5's cancel out and so this can now be written as 1 over 3 u to the fifth plus a constant of integration. Well now we're not done yet because now we want to substitute back what u was equal to in terms of x. So let's replace u by 3x minus 8 and so we now can say that this is equal to one-third times u to the fifth and u is 3x minus 8 so we can write 3x minus 8 to the fifth power plus a constant of integration and that here is the integrated form of the integral that you see up here. And this method is therefore a really useful method because if you don't have the proper differential here by using the method of substitution you can find the proper differential and then integrate it and substitute back and get the right answer like that. Okay, so if this was kind of bewildering, stay put. I have a lot more examples to come and after a while you say, okay, I can see the technique. That seems to be pretty straightforward. So let me show you all kinds of different ways in which the method of substitution can be used.